Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to unbox another three sets of Five Below Teeny Tiny's mini food sets. And I'm going to show you how they size up next to my Sylvanian families, also known as Calico Critters. You can see that the theme today are these candy mini play sets, Smarties, the Bazooka and Ring Pop set, and the Pez set. So let's start with this vibrantly colored Smarties mini play set. So these are the items unboxed. We have a big container, kind of like those huge containers of candy or nuts that you can get at Costco. And this is a container of Smarties. One says Smarties Original and one says Lollies. Next, we have this display box where you can get boxes of Smarties. It's a good idea and there's even a skew on the side of the box. Here we have a three pound bag of Smarties. It's a plastic piece with stickers on it. A lot of the stickers have the calorie and nutrition information on the backs of the label, which is a great detail. This container is super cute for getting your individual rolls of Smarties. The set comes with these six little rolls of Smarties. Cute enough, but I would have preferred if they were more realistic and looked like the stacks of pastel Smarties in clear plastic wrap. Here we have more bags of Smarties that you can buy in three different flavors. The red is original, the blue is tropical, and the green bag is extreme sour. Here is a closer look at the detail on the back label. And here you can see how all of the little accessories size up with the Sylvanian family's figures. There is a Fennec Fox mother figure and a chocolate Labrador daughter figure. Although the individual Smarties are slightly big for the critters, I think the overall sizing is quite good. The set comes with a display stand for the candies, which I will show you how to put together later. So the stand is quite tall for the Calico critters, so I don't know if I'll use them with my critters. I think I'll probably put all of the Smarties on Calico critter display shelves. There is this nice decorative cardstock piece for the back of the stand. Next, let's move on to the Bazooka Gum and Ring Pop combo mini display set. First, we have these two display containers for Ring Pops. The set comes with four individually wrapped Ring Pops with such cute detail of the packaging and they fit so well into the display containers. Here we have a big tub of bazooka gum. Next we have two pieces of bazooka bubble gum and another container they can be put in. I wish they included more pieces of the bubble gum. There's also another display container to put boxes of bazooka bubble gum in. This cube-shaped piece is supposed to represent stacks of bazooka bubblegum boxes. Lastly, there are these two smaller containers of bazooka bubblegum, and one is even labeled as sugar-free. Everything sizes very well with the Calico Critters. And I almost forgot to show you this piece here, which is supposed to be a large bag of ring pops. These are the pieces of the display stand and I'll show you really quick how to put it together. The height of the shelves is adjustable.
there's a really nice sign for the top of the display case. This colored piece can be attached to the back. Note that the back of each package shows you what's included and how to assemble the display case. I love this set. I do think the accessories are a perfect size for the critters. I do wish there were more individual bubblegum pieces. And again, the display stand is too tall for the critters, but I can use it in my one to 12 scale dollhouse dioramas. Lastly, we have the Pez set. How whimsical. These are all the items included pictured on the back of the packaging. The set comes with four individual Pez dispensers. How cute. The first one I think is a cupcake with cherry on top. The second one is a hamburger. And then there is a pizza and a taco. Good generic choices. There are two nice display containers for the Pez dispensers. Next, there are two boxes of Pez refills. These are pieces of plastic with stickers on it. The boxes don't open. They are very cute and you can see the different flavors of the refills. I think the Pez dispensers are a decent size for the critters, especially nowadays they're making these giant Pez dispensers, which weren't around when I was a kid. And in this candy set, you can buy individual Pez refills. I like the detail in these pieces. The first four are for original flavor Pez refills, and the next set of four are for sour Pez refills. Looking up close, you can see how sours is written on the label. Next, there are two plastic containers containing mini Pez, which is just a sticker on the inside of the container, but it's still a cute addition. These packages reflect a more classic size of Pez candy. And there are two different flavors, regular and sour to the right. And here's our display stand all assembled. Each of these sets is $5, and I just love having this classic candy for my dollhouse miniatures, as it is very difficult to find well-made candy miniatures at a good price. And Five Below also carries blind bags of calico critters. These are the recent ones I saw in the store just the other day. The store that I went to also had this more expensive Five Beyond section in the back where they had these two individual sets, the Raspberry Home and the Nursery for $20 each. Overall, I think these mini candies are super cute and I'm really happy to have them as options to add to my candy stores and the critters are very happy too.